girl Claire and I'm back with a video. If you're new here, you're much, much welcome. And if you're a returning subscriber, boom! God bless for coming back. So, guys, as you can see, the environment is a bit different. The surrounding, the background, the everything from the one you're used to. Uh, from the beginning of the video, guys, I showed you like mm, a sneak peek of me on the road heading back home. I came home yesterday morning, which was on, I, I arrived here yesterday friday morning today is on a saturday so i had some things to do of which i did them yesterday today is just a relaxing day at home me with my sisters my grandma so i was like hmm because it's been a while guys ever since i posted because um shoot but i know guys i've been doing some shots here and there motivational to videos to funny videos i hope you guys are loving them you are Nako encouraged in a way and I'm so grateful for the support. Nendelea ku grow pole pole too. So you must allow any fanya a small video of me in the village, guys. I just want to show you guys how my village looks. I am from the western part of Kenya, that is Mumias to be precise. So ni mesema. Bonam si kuja mumias na nyingi, bonam si fike. Now by the way, guys, I wasn't able to vlog from all the way from Naivasha to here because I traveled overnight. So definitely mna jo siku hakuna kitu ningefanya like new So guys as i was saying i traveled overnight so that means i couldn't do much you think as a cool vlog like mimi mimi tuna sima i don't have a camera nyenye sema tineza niza kuwa modified in a way of shooting at night that's why nilifanya tu some few videos in the morning at least mkaona barabara and then me on the on the dozy nikipeleka nikuja kwetu nikafanya shughuli fulani about my sister school of which now we are done to mm Mamaliza, -hmm. so today I could relax and then I'll be traveling back to Naivasha probably tomorrow. And then on Monday, I'm supposed to report back to my hustle. You guys, is a recall as a car was the car to it in a house. I'm gonna relax. You need to to nafaku hustle to nafaku hustle. So, guys, I just want you to take you through like to come with me as I spend my weekend at home in my village to end any own yeshe to be to be to to like things at least we familiar with where I come from. See what I say? This was my grandma's house. No, not the. My grandma was sick of it. I'm not the one say. I'm a fan of you durante sa po kando. Some landscaping. She's going to paint the gym. Very clean woman. Anyways, ni mo gya sana about my grandma. By the, I've been talking about grandma because mostly me na kanga kwa grandma. It's not that ni fan na kwa my mom. Ju my mom na grandma ni just we live in the same compound, but. Let me just niongelele grandma kidogo and then probably about my mom. It could be another video for you guys. So nataka ni wapeleke uko chini where our river is. Kwenye tunanga kufua. Jutuko na kisima guys but sometimes it doesn't like inakuanga na maji kidogo nini nini. So most of the times tunanga kufua kwa mtoni. So I want you guys to come with me as I take you towards that river and on the way nitakuwa naonyesha shamba yetu venye inakaa nini tumepanda nini nini so guys come with me tande mmeka guys 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 eh hizo maisha ya village you shall go for life this is me doing the dishes where is hapa guys hakuna mambo ya sink hapa ni kuinama you have to to to, to inama here, and this is where we, we do the anikari. That is where we put our viombos. They dry the African way. Look at this place, guys. So green, so cute, so lovely. I'm a no na jawasi. No na jawasi. Then it's wrong when I pick a color local background. I don't know what he's arguing with his grandma. Do you need one out here? Anyways, guys, I thought to show you and then to put on the other side of me showing you my western part of Kenya. See you guys. You guys, you're making noise. Hmm? That's last day. So guys, it's lunch time. We want to make some lunch. 
Tunaasha moto. I mean my grandma's kitchen by the way, guys. As you can see, unani could you call? Nita kuna mama. Unani eh? Shusha kona kuni eh? Una tukona mpaka hizi we have these ones with the nini tupetwa kwa this is from the maize we shelled. So we normally anika these thingy and then we use them as firewood. So now to pick a chele in some cabbage we are cutting over there. So that's what we'll be having for lunch. So I shall niache moto guys and then you prepare some lunch. And imagine guys it's already one. And I don't know why in the village people don't keep time. I don't know. I don't know. It's one like it's already one something one ten. Na ndo tunaasha moto. Tujapika mchele, atujakata cabbage. So probably we'll be eating our lunch around 3 or maybe to that is there. But anyways, it's village. So it is what it is guys. Such a pick it. Imagine I just wash a mop. This my guy over here. Yeah, na tupa tu. You just you just making my life complicated. Hmm? You making my life complicated, baby. Eh, baba. Who na fa yani zasa? Me na yaka moto. Yeah, na tupa ni sha msogoro ju. Vitu zinenda zikizima. Sasa guys. Me mi dasha moto papa sanga tu. No na aje. This is my grandma's kitchen, guys. No yo na aje. No yo na aje. Sina kafiri, ina kafiri, ina kafiri, ina kafiri. So guys, let's have to pick a bed to put on it. Bye, die. Like almost kuiva. Like atu wachaki pale kwa meko direct because it might end up burning. So we normally tunaitoa magic ideas and then tunaikelea makaju, makaini kona moto, so that the remaining water itaisha and then itaiva vizuri. Haita ungua hata kidogo. No say si kama gas ati utapunguza moto si juu nini and you have other things to cook so that is how we normally do it in our place. Ni mbele lo ba ize dunma kifanyanga ibo and rice inakuanga tamu. Na si anga tamu. So tunaika kumaka ibo and then we leave it for like let's say like ten minutes or twenty minutes and then we continue. So chachu karangi cabbage and then to kule lunch. Atu no chance anga tewa si. Hi guys. Guys. Hi. Papa you want me to go on the way? Yes. 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 So this is the cabbage that we cut. Your kukula line. So to nashanga remains to na iletea in a kula. Nizo nizo ndama ndama zake. Guys, this is village. The weather is so bad. I don't know if this cow will be able to drink water. Ana kula. Zika itaiza kukunywa maji. Because the weather is so bad, like. It's so bad. Kumenyesha kutoka asugui. But we are hoping itakunya maji because when it drinks water, in his idea at least, at the end of the day, we are able to get some good milk from it. Anyway, such a tuendo. Such a tuendo. Such a tuendo speaker. I wanted to show you something. I wanted to show you something. I wanted to show you where we store water in our village. Maji ya kukunya. Auku si mamona. This is the fridge of the village. Let me show you. So, but before I show you that, there's this kapot over here. This pot is where I put the nyama. This is where my grandma put the pikiyanga nyama. And this is a squeeze. Yet I didn't cut. I don't know why she usually just put the nyama. When did I? I'm a squeeze. I'm a cook modern and to me. Nyama is a cook expensive. And then this one. This was our fridge. Ili ni 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 put chukua dot me a kitambo a cook a maji. Then it can crack. So so easy. The cook just wants to try make a ni ni dani shuel. I can grandma. I make a maindi. Na i maindi. I tell you one bit. So so na i maindi. When you make a easy, it at me a cook a mbegu. This is a way of store, storing it so that it won't aita nini aita haribika like it won't dry nini it won't like kuoza or something ama kupatwa na maji unajua moisture uharibu mahindi so the pot that we are using right now ndio hii this is what we are using right now na iko na hicho ni wakulima maji na wenyewe maji ni safi na ni baridi guys acha nikunye mpika Yo maji ni baridi. This is the fridge. Wacha na hiyo ya fridge. Na ni pure water from the river. Pure water from the river. Nga wapeleka kwa hiyo river muwane ni venye tu kumenyesha. Right now I don't think kama mtu unezendo huko. Because kumeteleza. 
Na msimai ndi bed. Hii bed ilikuwa ngaa shosha yangu. Kitabu, 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 kitabu. Kwa sababu sisi tunayepanga toka kitchen, haitumiki, haifanyiki nini. So tunakuja tu tunakaa hapa tunapiga mshene. No one sleeps here. Anyways, guys. I, I was talking about ya kuwekelea makaa juu. Unaona mchele ijaungua hata kidogo. It hasn't and the water is dried out. Fully 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 fully. So hiyo ni taktiki ya village shown by my grandma. And our lunch is ready. Abapo ni sangapi? Saa 8, si ndio? Ni saa 8? 17. Imagine. African time, village time to be precise. Wacha tukule lunch. Mm. Mm. Guys. No na ze huku ni kwetu. No na ze huku kwetu. How how do you look? How do you how do you see this place? Hii ni pia grass yetu, ni ya ngombe. And then huku ni hivi wametuanisha mahindi, si ndio? Mm. Wametuanisha mahindi. And then you have some cassava over there. Tunaenda nyeshe. The other side huko kuna kunde. Huko umepandwa kunde and then you have some sukuma over there. Kuna there is some sweet potatoes the other side. Then you come from this. Who is the cat? There is some renda here. Renda. Look at it. This is the renda, guys. And this is the nini. This is where the seedlings are. Not the seedlings. Oh my god. The seeds. Seeds is up and down. So we in a kauka and then in a gongeshua. And then the seeds in a pandua into another place. They are but as they mature, so there is no way to tune as They haven't matured. They take more than one year to be okay. A year or so. Do you know about your stand? Yes, I hear your six months. Then here we have some mapera, a guava tree. But guavas, but those go to Dogo, do easy. They are still young, but don't need to Dogo. Oh, and Kali. I think one of the many guavas, but I think this one is. Let me see. I think this one is. I know. I think this one is good. No, no. Even a jaiva, but in coma. You go to. You go to Kikwanja. You come and pick it, and then you peel the 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 outer coat, and then you eat the the seed. Where? Let me tell you guys. Kule maparamingi. Kwenda cho. Especially more because we don't want our cows to starve to death. And then pile, I don't know if you guys can see. Let me zoom for you, Mone. Apo Ivo. This one. This one is sweet potatoes. But they are not mature yet, so. Mm -hmm. And then you have some trees. No, no, a meaty. There are our trees to make a couple because of. Um, how do you call it? Soil erosion. It's yes. helping to control soil erosion. Because uku ni chini kabisa, so sometimes magic tokana uko ju, it comes with a lot of force, so it carries away the, the soil from, from this side. So erosion do happen. So that's why we, we normally plant trees to help in controlling that. Yeah. And these are a source of rain. Yes. This is our nini. We, we don't use this mini anymore because the guys, this are my let me tell you guys, forty. These bananas, they used to be a lot. Now they are longer, very sweet bananas, very sweet ones. It's even called sweet banana. But people started behaving in a way of every time a banana is almost, almost mature when I harvest even before us. So we decided to shift all our bananas to Kasipeleka compound. I'll show you guys. So this one, in a car, that's two apple, but we don't use it. Our hey, grandma. Boga. Hmm? 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 Hmm?
Ni wadudu? Mm. Wewe guys, hawa wadudu wanatoka huko kwa nipi? Guys wanazikula. So wewe tunashindwa. Guys supposed to be. But anyways, this is my favorite vegetable. Still we have Napier. Mm-hmm. More Napier. More more Napier. Yeah. Hii mbogi imekanyagwa shwali. Yes. Yes. This kunde for your And then on the other side pale kuna skuma. Skuma. Kunda ndio huko. And then up to here we have it. Yes. We have kunde here. Guys, come. Come I show you nini. Arrow root, yes. 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 Yes, nduma. Yams. No, there's a difference between arrow root and yams. Ikipiku inakuwa no, it's not about kupika. These ndo mazetu guys. Wa arrow root. Are they arrow root or yams? Arrow root. I think so. A yams ni? I don't know. Okay. Guys, hata huku pia hizi ndo mazao sio uiba. People are still people are still harvesting even before us. This is Kenya for us. But there was even a point where my mom gave up like aliyesema hey haizi panda nduma tena but ni venye tunazipenda akakuwa zile za acha tupande tena bila na kanyaga mboga mmm kanyaga mboga guys come i show you the rhythm my pear is still there mo my pear mo go have a tree yes ndo hizo hizo ni refu Unafulia kwa shamba yetu. Kai una wala kutukua. Cut. Natukua. Here is a river. Nuna iko na maji safi guys. It has clean water. Baba stop. Stop. Stand there. Please. Kai Jesus. Wasana waambieni huku ndo tunakuja kukua. Hii maji ni safi. But ukikuta ukikuta hapa saa 4, there is always a big snake, a black one which normally passes here every saa 4. With the, with the kids. Yeah, I think so. This water is very clean but in the bad way. What? Kwa watu nakuja hapa tunafua. My sister is even washing cloth over there. Who on issue? Hey guys, we are washing your cloth. <laughs> and my cousin. We are washing our hair in laundry. Cousin smile. Hi guys. We are busy here. Busy here. Busy, 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 busy with here. Dina. Mama dindo huyo. <laughs> so guys, I think Ma huyu nani? Mama. Guys, I think I've been able to show you ma Mama. Baba calm down. Eh? Calm down. So. Mm, I think guys I've been able to show you much. Shamba yetu ni kubwa. I don't think I can be able to cover it all. Just say hakuna vitu mingi zimepandwa cuz I think it's January. Normally January, February is the time when plants zinakuwa prepared for the next next planting of maize and beans and blah 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 and in terms of fruits i think right now we have maperas and avocado mapera avocado arrow roots in terms of fruits oh, i'm talking about fruits we mapera, have mapera avocado avocado and some bananas but some bananas is what about papaya we have papaya at our yeah, mom's papaya are there i have yeah, yeah, guys I'll, yeah. I'll, I'll go i'll go and show you that papaya and there's a there's an avocado tree which have I'm been here for the past 20 more than 30 okay. years uh uh yeah, 60 yeah. something <laughs> around 60 years but there guys i don't know if you can see those i don't know how they are called i know the name in my native language we call them thinengi this this these creatures Kitambo tulikuwa tunaambiwa when you take one and then you bite it, like it bites you on your nipple your breasts will grow faster i don't know i never tried it so i'm not sure if it's actually true but i don't know i don't know simna ziona guys i'm trying to catch one zina nitoroka because they are very fast when it comes to swimming but hey guys hizi mawe zinakuanga very slippery so mtu unakujanga na sabuni sabuni unaingiza hapa and then unasugua hizi usugua your leg huh you usugua your leg like this and then your leg nakuwa safi this is tunafanyanga hii inaitwa nini 
Muruto. This is pedicure. Tunaoshanga miguu huko. Pedicure in the village. This is how we normally do it. Unasugua hapa, unasugua hapa and then you come where you are left and then you good to go. So guys, up here I decided to go for a bicycle ride. You can imagine guys. So the reason as to why I did that is because it's been quite like a while ever since I did bicycle riding and you know in the village we used to use like a bicycle so much fetching water going to the portion mill so it's something that I was used to up until when you in the high school college uh, haven't been doing that but guys it was such an, an exercise on its own because at the end of this bicycle riding I was so tired like literally tired but I enjoyed myself. Look at me, look at me, look at me, guys. Yeah? Crazy me. Yeah? <laughs> Anyways. This was the bananas I was telling you. We shifted from the other side to Cochini. Because we put Napandanga the other side. I told you guys. Theft, theft made us to shift from there so they are being planted here you up on the homestead too by the way guys because we have a very big compound so to Leona, instead of kukanga evil let's do this bananas and you can see they are doing very well by the way we harvest a lot a lot a lot from this section mm. mama mekata ni jana mama likata jana hapa ya kuiva na za kuiva na za kupika and you're hoping to find the, the whole of this place to put on a mandizi, 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 mandizi. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My busy. I'm not going to be a new one. I'm not My brother is the one who normally does that. So, yeah, guys. Guys, this is the avocado tree. I was telling you, who come avocado ni more by the way, Ziko Mingi by the way, there are so many like so 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 many and they are very nice, they are so sweet. This tree, according to my, according to my grandma, the one who planted this tree was my uncle, the eldest one, Juata my dad is after him. So the, my grandma said that the uncle planted this tree when he was around 15 years, 12 years over there. So, and right now, he's in 60s. So you can imagine how long this tree has been there. And every year, it's yielding something amazing for us. Now he, I've been trying to come to the for the past years, ever since I was a kid. I've been trying to come to the tree for now. Hmm? What is this tree? It's a tree, guys. It's a tree. Guys, the yo popo to go now. Yo, niliwambia guys to go now fruits. Msijali ati hatuna sahani. Don't mind. This is village life. Hmm? Una venyina kaa vizuri. Look so nice. So guys, tunapika tu chapati. We want to make some chapati for supper. Hmm? Yu shango yetu by the way. Atuko mbaya vile guys. I can't complain. Tunapika tu chapo. Then, hmm? Tuko wengi. So that's why we are tunazipika mingi yu. It's just to pick a pick here, and then yeah. Look at that rolling stick. Look at this rolling stick that the one my mom has. Surely, surely, mom. So, guys, I think I've been able to show you around my place. We don't have that much because we are a middle class people. No, are we poor? No, we are not poor. We are middle class because we are able to get to get a three course meal at the end of the day. So, see, this is my sister, my skinny because. And we are thankful for that. So that has been my video of me in the village. I've been able to show you around. I've been able to show you what we have in Kukukwetu Western. And I think you loved the video. So thank you so much guys for watching today's video. Hope you have enjoyed it. Remember to subscribe. Until next time. Bye bye. God bless. Love from Western part of Kenya.